good morning and welcome to today's upload my name's emma sticking around for hauls and vlogs and chats i would love you to subscribe leave me a little comment i'm always dipping in there after the videos having a little chitty chatty i am doing a much requested and much waited for video i'm finally getting to primark hooray it's been a while the children have been off for all sorts of various things so it's been hard for me to get out of the house but i am out and i'm gonna have a little look around primark i'm gonna show you all the bits i'm gonna go around homeware i'm gonna look at disney stuff and i am mainly looking at summer holiday stuff summer stuff i've got specific things i want to get there is a, I want to get a big long white shirt so when I go around the pool put it over my swimming costume and I can look really sophisticated so that's one thing we're looking for I want to get some inflatables for in the pool so that's another thing I want to look for rather than buying wherever we go on holiday and then being loads of money take our own all nicely packed in a box I also need to get my 12 year old some kind of smarter summer stuff and actually i'm in merry hill um, and i might pop in a lot of you suggested the 9 to 15 range in new looks so i might look in there as well um and see what's what so there's just various bits and bobs but i'm going to show you all the other stuff that is there that is available maybe i might get myself a new frock i am going to see harry styles soon ah, i can't wait and when you watch this, this is the day before I'm going to Eurovision, which is a long life dream of mine. So I might see if there's anything fun there I can, you know, that I can take to wear for that. So, uh, yeah, I can't. Oh, definitely follow me into stories because tomorrow, Thursday, will be a Eurovision packed event. Um, and if you're not a Eurovision fan, just go and watch and just see a 45 year old woman with her 41 year old not 41 claire wishes 43 year old sister living their best lives right let's have a go and look around i'm in merry hill by the way because people all want to want to know what prime mark i'm in it's merry hill let's go just a little reminder that the merry hill prime market does have a disney cafe which is good and it sells like mickey waffles and all sorts of things so if you're in the area definitely pop in i absolutely love this top this is five pound, definitely gonna get that. It's looking a bit yellow on the screen, but it's white. So I'm definitely going to pick up one of those. That is a really sweet little holiday top. I also, she doesn't need a costume, but the costume is so pretty. And I love that, but I don't think, I don't think she'd wear that. That is eight pound. No, I don't think she'd be having, oh, that's quite a cute little, oh, and that skirt's really nice as well. There's some nice stuff in. I like that skirt a lot. That is eight pounds. That's really cute as well. That might be an option. They have lots of really sweet, the little casual outfits. This is a cute little jumpsuit. I'm not sure. Oh, should go up to, yeah, this is a nice little jumpsuit. Um, this is five pound, what a bargain. I like that, I'm wondering, because my girl's quite tall, maybe I need to get a bigger, a bigger size actually, because she's got super long legs, not like me. <laughs> oh yeah, that's, that's really cute. This is 10 pounds and I absolutely love it, but she would not like that, I don't think, but I do really like that. Um, she does like white actually. I don't think they have that in size, but yeah, I'd wear that. Primark make that in adult sizes. Maybe they will when we go downstairs. That'll be thrilling. She should be even less inclined. If I was like, oh, we can go imagine. Oh, no, seven to eight's on the wrong hanger. Don't you hate it when that happens? Definitely don't need any more shorts because we have got millions of pairs of shorts, if you remember rightly. But maybe I could get her like a basic kind of skirt that could be worn with all sorts of different tops. That's very sweet. Oh my gosh, you just hear me bonk my head. <laughs> I nearly knocked myself out in Primark. That'd be a video, I could sell it to uh, You've Been Framed. How much is that? That is eight pound. See if it's her size. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. 
This would be so fun for Harry Styles for, wouldn't it? What would you wear it over? Like a white t-shirt or something? That is so lovely. They've got such nice stuff in. This is a good, this is a good Primark. Maybe I should just get her like a plain, oh, like a plain combat skirt. She loves combats. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the stuff, show her the, get to try it on and if she doesn't like it, I'll bring your stuff back. But I think a plain combat skirt might save me and this summer. Yeah, that's lovely, but I do love the little crochet thing. It looks so, I don't know if she'd think I'd gone crazy if I got her that though. It's 11 pound. This one's so sweet as well. And I love all the t-shirts, but t-shirts is not something that we need. Um, but that might be quite a nice top for an evening. It's five pounds. But oh, I just, I might risk it. I might risk getting a one and then, if she doesn't like it, I can always bring it back. Can't I like over the top of her cosy? I just think that's such a sweet little top. Yes, yeah, I think I'm gonna get one of these five pound tops as well. Um, they've got some nice little t-shirts. Like pop kind of fun t-shirts. When I say stuff like that, I sound, when I say like it's pop and it's fun, I sound like literally the most old fashioned person in the history of the universe. I am trying to find, oh, this Mickey stuff so cute. I'm trying to find like, maybe just a smart, shirt he's got some in trunks we've got a million pairs of shorts i just want a couple more little smart things oh it's so frustrating the bigger boy stuff from primark is never as nice as the little boy stuff just want some shirts or something like smart but it's never as nice he's already got that at home it's just, oh hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. This is in the one to eight section. This is in the one to eight section, but it's looking, oh yes. I feel so triumphant <laughs> because also my boy loves a jazzy shirt. So these are six pound, I feel like, yeah, these are six pound. Um, so he loves, he loves a crazy shirt. So I'm really pleased actually, because I thought, oh gosh, it's just nothing in here. Oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's loads. It's just in the wrong part of the shop. Oh no, I think I prefer this one. Don't you think this one's really 90s? Oh, I think I'm gonna swap one. Okay, this wasn't quite what I was looking for, but it's similar, like a white shirt. I've got some in costumes, um, so I don't need those. But I did, I should have, you know when you see something and you don't get it, I should have got it when I saw it. I just wanted like a, a giant white shirt, but they've got loads of nice swimming stuff in. But as I say, I've already got a couple of costumes. I don't need any more. Um, I might be tempted by a pair of shorts, maybe, just to throw on. Uh, oh, it's all looking like they've only really got the smaller sizes left. But maybe I can try and grab a pair of shorts. I found the white shirt, I'll show you later. Oh, there's so much nice swimming stuff on. Could you let me know in the comments if you are plus size, if you've ever tried the Primark stuff, what's it like? This looks so comfy, but I'm not sure it would hold me bits in. Let me know, please, but there's loads of cover-ups. But again, I do have quite a few. I like this style of dress, like a tiered dress. Um, yeah, that's really cute. I'm not sure, but I have got a green dress. I'm not really sure. That does look very nice and would be quite a light. I'm sure they've got it in my size, but yeah, I like that dress. That's very pretty. Guys, I burn a lot. Would it be crazy to run to get this? I just want a nice hat to just sit around a pool and that looks like a nice hat to sit around a pool in. Okay, let's hit the homeware. Um, that picture is beautiful. I love this is just my, I'm going to say it, babe. I love <laughs> Every video I'm like, I love baskets. But I do. I'm not lying. I absolutely love them. I love them so much. Um, let's have a look over here. 
This is some gorgeous stuff. That blanket's beautiful. This would have been uh, nice when we were doing my girls' bedroom. Oh my gosh, they've got some. <gasps> she would love that. How much is that? £4.50 for that. I'm going to get that for her bedroom. Like that is, is that not the most perfect tween? I feel like a bit, like I could cry a bit, that's so perfect. I'm getting that £4.50. If you go back and watch, this is the Primark vase that was in my girls room. I love this vase as well, which is £7. But that vase is beautiful, it's such a good quality. They have got some, oh my gosh, really good stuff in here and it, oh. It is. <laughs> Emma is in heaven. I love all this is just my, the kind of stuff I love, all like wicker and baskets and plants and all stuff. This isn't relevant for me, but I thought it might be relevant for you. And then again, straight away I saw this. And she could put a little picture in this, couldn't she? That's £2.50. And this is gorgeous stuff if you've got um, younger kids. The homeware stuff in Primark, it really is exceptional. They like take stuff that's on Pinterest um, and it's just so reasonably priced. Oh, it's really, really good. I'm gonna go and see if they've got any um, inflatables now as well. This stuff here is all gorgeous as well. I love it, all this kind of, would you say it's like maybe Spanish inspired? I'm sure somebody will correct me if I'm talking absolute rubbish, but it's lovely. not big enough for me <laughs> you know like a big mug guys I've decided I'm gonna come back and do a full Disney video when we go to Florida so later because I think I filmed a million things um, but they've got some really nice accessories in at the moment this would be great for around the park to so pop your bag not your bag what am I talking about your phone in and um, they've got some cute jewellery which seems to be in the wrong bit but these I know my girl would love to wear these in the park <gasps> it's that hat again it's the hat we've also got lots of earrings toiletries bags stitch stuff <gasps> the stitch beach bag which is really sweet and some lanyards but yeah as I said I will come back and do like a full Disney one but if you are looking for Disney ears at the moment for £5.50 there's these ones and for £3.50 those ones there so yeah if you are looking for Disney ears these are in the shops at the moment hello are you balancing on a plant pot as per usual I thought you were gonna do a bit of a tip I'm pulling my leggings up because that's what sometimes us ladies or people that wear leggings like to do uh, I have to say, 10 out of 10 recommend Merry Hill Primark. 10 out of 10 recommend it. It was gorgeous. The home wear section was quiet. Oh, it was just lovely. So I'll show you some of the bits and bobs that I got. As you may recall, we were looking for summer stuff. There were no floaties. If you ever see any reasonably priced inflatables, please do let me know. Let me know in the comments. Go and uh, message me on Brummy Mummy of two. Let me know there. So, picked up some shirts for my boy. This was seven pounds. When I tell you, he loves a jazzy shirt. And I showed him and he was like, loves a jazzy shirt who doesn't this one was also seven pound i got them all aged 10 to 11. i did consider it the old uh should i get the next size up which sometimes i like to do and i thought oh no do you know what i'm looking at this wall there's some right mucky handprints somebody somewhere along the line has slapped a big old mucky handprint on my wall i've not noticed it before but i you know you just like when you're a mum, you're like, what's that? Like a big handprint. Anyway, uh, I didn't get, didn't size up because it looked like it was going to be massive. So, stuck with this and he will just love these. Right, I'm going to show you something now. 
So this is seven pound. It's gorgeous. Love it. In the men's department is matching. It's a little bit of a different red, but it's matching. So the boys can match. In fact, this is more of an orange, but the boys can match. And if you know they love a fancy dress and stuff like that, you know those two boys will be thrilled to match. However, I'm not so sure that Maya <laughs> should have got me and Erin one as well. I'm going to go together. She'd be like, <sighs> no, I hope they always want to match. But, you know, as they grow up, these things change, don't they? And that's fine. But yeah, this men's one, oh, because he tried it on, the, the tag has gone. Unsure how much that one was. I don't like it was eight pound maybe so if you have you know got some people that want to match with their dads or granddads or uncles or whoever Primark's the way forward right my girls clothes which I've um, yet to show her I'm going to show her after this and we'll be returning anything she's not a huge fan of so all size 12 to 13 apart from one thing it's got this top which is five pound i thought this is very pretty this may also be another harry styles outfit option really like that we've ordered some like pink very similar colors to this actually like swirly leggings so that would look great with that this is this thing that i sized up in because she's lovely and tall so i thought this might have more chance of covering it it's like a little jumpsuit you know just you can chuck it over your bikini i suppose if you're having a little walk around so that was i did mention earlier and that was five pound that is a bargain a bargain i really like this this is five pound and they did it in all different colors it's pink it's a little bit long at the front it's almost like corseted it's actually super nice material i think she'll really like that that's the one i think she'll most like and sure about the green to be honest couple of white tops this was five pound as well i thought that was very sweet just a little top that can be either worn during the day or it could be worn at night i mean that's logical emma those can be worn Emma, for whenever uh this was five pound as well and it's like a little um, off the shoulder Again, I thought I could fit in this. <laughs> could you imagine me trying this on? I looked like I was stuffed in sausage skin or something. This is a beautiful skirt. And again, this may be one that she's not a fan of. You know, she usually 99.999% of the time picks her own clothes, but because I was there. So this might be one that might be returned, but I did like it. I thought this is very cute with a little white top, some white converse. I thought that was very sweet. So we'll see what she thinks. I shall let you know, or you might see it on my Instagram stories or something. Go and follow me on Instagram, Brummy Mummy of Two. And then I got random stuff. I didn't get the hat that I showed you a million times. You stop laughing. Stop laughing. Do I look like Liam Gallagher? Sure. But will I have the sun off my eyes? Also, sure. I am a pale beauty um and i like to have a hat around the pool i like to have a hat in the pool sometimes because i get so flipping sunburnt just despite having factor 50 all day sunblock on so this will be invaluable and it was only four pound and it folds up nicely and can be packed very easily look how stylish my hair looks now i picked up this bag <laughs> It is, um, oh my gosh, it was eight pound. But the, I will have this for the rest of my days. It's a sparkly belt. As I'm doing Eurovision, I'm doing Harry Styles. I have ordered a black sparkly jumpsuit and I thought this might look nice with it. If you're a similar sort of size to me, always get a medium belt. If you, so I wear my belt up high. I mean, this would not go around my waist, but it goes around the top. Um, so, yeah. This. You'll be seeing this for years to come. If I'm still on here when I'm 60 and I'm wearing a jazzy outfit, it will be with this belt. With an investment piece. I also 
I tend to wear the same earrings um, all the time, little gold ones, and I thought, you know what, if I'm going on a nice little holiday, I think I might go for a little bit of a, a little bit of a jazzy earring, £3.50, a bit of turquoise. I thought, I have not worn a jazzy earring in a long time. So that, that was great. I got these for £2.50, which I will share with my girl around, uh, you know, when we were just around the pool and you can just shove our hair up. I love all these, these kind of 80s and 90s clasper things coming back in fashion. I love them, I love them. Right, I'm gonna try these on with you. Don't worry, I'm not getting my swimming costume yet. That will be on Instagram at some point soon. I bought both extra large. Some cover-ups I have for the summer, like a, go and check out my Instagram, I did a reel, like a try -on. I have like a teal cover-up, obviously I would not be wearing it over a, um, a Rolling Stones t-shirt, oh that's fine. Teal cover-up, not cover-up, a teal cosy, which I thought would be nice with this little cover-up because it kind of matches. Now I'm thinking, does it match? But it does kind of match. And you know, you just want something to cover your bum when you're walking around the pool. Perfect. That was, actually that was more expensive than I would usually spend on something like this, but it's super good quality and it is something that I, again, you know what us mums are like with our, I mean, I've got Primark beach cover-ups from like pre-children. Me and my mother have got matching ones. So that'll be a really nice, I don't know, just a nice, you know, you sometimes just want to feel a bit glamorous. Note self, don't wear this with a bucket hat. And then the other thing that I was really looking for was I watched at White Lotus and Aubrey Plaza. Now I'm wondering if that's a name. If it's not, please, please correct me. Or a little, I've got a black swimming costume for Marks and Spencers. She just have like a little white shirt over and I thought, oh my gosh, that looks so flipping classy. So I thought I would just get like a little, I'd have my black swimming costume. I just, I shouldn't have done this. Oh yeah. I'd have my black swimming costume just with a little, a white shirt. Just roll up the sleeves. And people will be like, she was she on White Lotus? And I'll be like, no guys, Emma from Birmingham. But this was just what I was looking for and I saw something similar on ASOS maybe for £25 and this was £8. This, I'm not sure, will last very long. It is made of the... Oh, I thought it had a bit of a run in it then. It's made of very fine material. But just to chuck on round the pool, obviously, please use your vast imagination. I probably could have sized down, it's huge, but... <gasps> Oh, glamorous. So glamorous. And it's gonna crumple like an absolute crumply thing. And then I've got a few homeware bits. This is for this room and this is just beautiful colours. And I loved it and I thought it looked very expensive. Can you see it kind of matches the babe at five pound. It's Turbo Rose and Pink Pepper. What's Turbo Rose? Let me know in the comments. I just thought this. Very no, I'm looking at it. Is it all oh, tumbling? No, it, I just thought it matched very well with this room. So I'm looking forward to getting that. Putting that somewhere. I picked up a couple of these. These are 80p. The fresh linen is just delightful. It is such a lovely, lovely smell. And I will have that, like I have one in my bathroom and then I have one in my utility room. Always, if you can, opt for fresh linen. Opt for cotton. Opt, oh, I've got a bird just for you. The bird go past then. Opt for, like, wedding days and a baby powder is another great smell. I can't smell that. I don't know why, I don't know why, I don't know why I, I, I kiss that man. Um, I got this, so... My girl met Olivia Rodrigo when we went to New York. I, 
I, I presume most of you know that. I met Olivia Rodrigo when I went to New York. It was amazing. Um, by chance. And she wants a picture up in her bedroom. So I'm, I'm going to print off a little picture. And I thought that would look very pretty in her room. With a picture of her and Olivia Rodrigo. Get for you. Looking happy and healthy. Not me. Um, these are brilliant. And they're £1.50 for 15 treatments. Say what? Brighten and Lindsay Puffin eye patches for dull and tired eyes with vitamin C, peptides and licorice. Mm -hmm. Don't eat them. Got that. And then I saw they did another one. Whenever things are in black packages, I just think, well, they must be for men. But that it's, it's, I don't know why I think that. This is hydrating and revitalising. Um, so this is with lavender, caffeine and collagen. And you're not, I could do with a bit of collagen. So I'm about 50 each. And I'm telling you now, somebody said keep them in your fridge. And I'm going to keep them in my fridge. I might keep them in Erin's little fridge actually. They're fab. Sometimes, just, sometimes you know when you just feel a bit like, bleh. You know when you wake up and you're just like, bleh. And you've got like a do the scorn or you've got like a busy day at work. Or I don't know, you've got a busy day at college. And you just feel like, Sometimes I just wake up, put these on for 15 minutes while I'm making the bed or putting the washing away or whatever, anything, and I just feel like a bit fancy and I like it. And I also got this picture which was £4. Also I've noticed got a bit of a, a bit of a rip in the back. Not ideal, but we shall it will be fine. It'll be fine. £4.50. I thought that would be fab in her room. I loved it. Great. Well done. Love it all. So there we go. There is a little Primark, a little mooch. What a gosh. I had an absolutely delightful time. I will see you soon for another upload. So we are going to be going away in half term for just a pool holiday, which uh, is... Stephen's favourite kind of holiday. If you follow me on Instagram, you know this. So, um, I was thinking of doing the ultimate, the ultimate pack with me, like a really long, like a long pack with me. A real long chatty one. So that'll be coming up in a few weeks. Hold on to your hats. And don't forget, I release a podcast every Monday called The Phone Box Podcast. The episode this week, if you're from the Midlands or from Birmingham or you live in a different country and you miss the Birmingham accent, is an episode with Marverine, who is a, a, a Birmingham TV presenter. And if you love Disney, don't forget the episode before that was Adam Hatton. Morning! Adam Hatton. He was on it. So definitely go and check out both of those podcasts. You will love it. I've got some really exciting things coming up on the podcast um, that I cannot wait for you to hear. And next week is going to be a boy band special. So we're chatting all about boy bands. So oh, it's just fantastic. Anyway, I'm talking a load of rubbish. I love you lots. And I will see you soon for an upload or over on Instagram. Bye. She liked the clothes, just to let you know. I showed her all the clothes and she liked the clothes. I win, I win, I win! Is it, she especially liked the, the grips. She really liked the grips.